one day she texted me ah, you text me or you call me and she texted me and she said I already convert to Islam. Right. Okay, I come back I marry you. <laughs> Customer uh, banyak minta kami buka restoran. Yeah, so difficult to find Vietnam or you know Vietnam halal food one. And uh, I want to come here because I open the restaurant because I want to cook more item for any people can try with them. My wife is the head chef. She, you know, she sticks to tradition in, the, in terms of preparation, semua kan. Uh, and and that's why when we put it out, we don't call it just furball. We should rather we call it classic furball. That means how you get it, how you experience it. Back in Vietnam, is the same thing that you're experiencing in Singapore. Lah. After the pandemic, and then you know the customer your feedback, and then they say, "Well, you just open the restaurant so our family all can come." And then the opportunity came in short, I don't know, at Kampung Lam, so we just say, "Just, just jump into it, lah." Hari ini kami di Eminami mencuba santapan makanan Vietnam. So, okay, dah dia banyaknya makanan yes, depan kita. Aku tak tahu mana satu nak mula dulu. <laughs> But let's start dengan lebih klasik lah, eh. Lebih klasik. So, so, Furbo, which is furbo, furbo, which is fur daging lah, uh, mm. daging uh, lembu. Betul, okay, betul. kita boleh cuba. Okay, so sekarang kami akan cuba furbo. So the punya sup ni direbus uh, selama 15 hingga 20 jam setiap wow. hari. Wow. Eh. Macam mana nak describe dia punya rasa? Daging dia lembut gila. It's really soft. Punya uh, bau sop dia tak sangat... Um, ham, macam ada kan dia punya daging itu hamis sikit kan? Tapi ni tak. Sebab dia rebus lama, empuk, sangat-sangat harum dia punya uh, sop dia. Dan ringan lah. Very aromatic. Betul tu.